Bobo here at Twisted Diesel Tuning. Just want to do a quick overview of how to retrieve your authentication code and the serial number off your AutoCAL or your V2 cable so you can order a license or better known as a VIN unlock code from EFI Live so you can tune more uh, vehicles uh, with your cables. So first thing you want to do is uh, with your software all up to date and everything uh, good to go on your uh, boot block and your um, firmware on your cable uh, plug in your cable with your USB port um, and then just go to your EFI Live scan and tune open that up there now you see down here under F7 there's an option for licenses just click that you'll see your cable flash a little bit and then it's gonna load up your uh, license information now you see up here there's a, a little button that EFI Live has put in there for you. It says copy. What that does is it, it just copies your serial number to your clipboard. So now I'm going to go into my email program. I've already got that open. I just use Alt Tab to navigate through Windows. Go to Mozilla here. All right, got my email opened up. Um, I'm just going to hit Control V as in van and paste my serial number in here. All right, hit enter a couple of times. I'm going to go back into the EFI Live program, hit Alt Tab. There we are. Okay, so now I got the serial number pasted into an email. Now over here I'm going to click on VINs, and all the VINs for this cable are going to show up here. And down in the bottom you see it's got an authentication code. Again, there's a tab that says Copy. Click Copy. Alt Tab back over. Control V is in van, paste that baby in there. And now you can email that serial number and authentication code to your tuner. They can get you a license for your AutoCAL or for your V2. It'd be nice if you put in the email also that it's for a V2 or if it's for an AutoCAL. I'm not 100% sure if you have to have that information. But when we order licenses, our VIN unlocks from uh, EFI Live, they ask us what it's for now. Um, so I've been putting in there if it's for a V2 or an AutoCAL, and I've even gone as far as saying it's for a Duramax diesel or it's for a Cummins also. So if you could uh, enter any of that information in there, um, your tuner would probably be able to use that in case uh, you don't want your uh, license being held up. So. Uh, Bob, Bobo here at Twisted Diesel Tuning, just a little tip on how to do that. Again, um, I was in my EFI Live version 8 software and uh, did everything right through there uh, under the VINs tab and the uh, hardware tab up here. Um, there's serial number, authentication code, and again it's under the licensing tab over here when you open up your uh, version 8 scan and tune. Thank you.